Eight, seven, four metres, it's the Labuk Sazarovic final, and off we go. Five first away from six, those one in behind that, and four, two's in behind that, and three. Round the first bend, though, for the leader, it's Savannah Aguirre that's charged to the front, though, with Savannah Volcano towards the outside, Beach Babe also new enough, three in line with two laps to go. In behind them, though, Kilshay Marie's trying to make a bit of progress, though, Blueberry put in Antigo Lava is towards the back at this early stage, though. Down to the next bend we go, though, Savannah Aguirre still leads to Dying Henry, though, upsides, though, is Savannah Volcano. Okay, now also by Diane Henry. In behind them is Beach Babe. Next is Kilshammy Marie towards the back. Blueberry Bullet still a lap to go. This is now the final lap. Five is the leader, though. Savannah Okano has now finally got past four and now leads down the back straight the final time. Beach Babe is starting to make steady progress into second, though. In behind them is Kilshammy Marie. Two from the back. Blueberry Bullet is flying as well. They're round the Panorama, but turns ahead round to the final bend. Five still out in front. Savannah Okano out in front, but Diane Henry is going on to win the Labux Azarovic final. Beach Babe in second. Well, winner of the 2022 Labrook Cesarich was Savannah Volcano. And uh, that was, the right was on the wall a long way out there, Kim, because she's class and she started ever so well. Four and a half years old, Dave. Coming out like that, middle, stays, phew, what I want, 56.04 as well. So, <laughs> staggering. I mean, what a bitch, you know, we've been lucky to own her for the last two, two and a half years, but yeah, that's brilliant. I mean, you it, love a stay art. This is what it's all about, uh, right? The consistency to churn out performance after performance. I, th I think the run she did in the St. Ledger, getting beat a length, flying, you know, at, at the age of years and then bringing her here, she's still enjoying it. She absolutely thrives on the racing and, and that was a classy run, very classy. And, well, I think I was getting a nosebleed when she turned second and the uh, kennel mate was in front, but no, nah, fantastic. Absolutely having room, though. Before she escapes, I'm going to grab a very, very quick word with Diane. Um, just a word on, on this lady. Outside of what she's achieved today, Diane, uh, she's been a fantastic bitch for you, hasn't she? She's just been brilliant, and it's going to be a sad day when I do actually retire her. Um, I mean, she's, she seems to be running better than she ever has, uh, but it's, it's just, just brilliant. I thought the key to the race today was for her to to turn handy quite quickly and she did and uh, it's brilliant and uh, yeah I'm really I'm really chuffed honestly yeah and a testament to yourself how, how consistent she's been going she's four and a half years old and she's still serving it up to the best stars in the country yeah it's it, it's quite amazing really at this age and and still producing these runs at top level it is it's, it's uh, quite staggering but she loves she loves her racing and until she tells me she's had enough then I'll, I'll keep uh, entering her in for these big races yeah good stuff well, we'll in keep enjoying watching her race as well enjoy that brilliant performance savannah volcano winning the cesarich